All right, guys, welcome back to Bug Snacks. Um, last time we were just coming back to see what was up with uh, Bethlehem, and I believe she had us scan all the snacks here, fill up your journal, then we can swap deets. Yeah, but okay, don't so. be surprised if they're not all out at the same time. Bug Snacks got to sleep too. She wanted us to scan more bug snacks, some bungers. Ah, oh, it's a white strawberry. So they should be relatively easy to catch. Oh, what? Nice. <laughs> Alright. So we just need one more in this area. Um, these piles of dirt have eyes? What in the world? I think this is a new area, so I don't think this counts as uh, Flavor Falls, Garden Grove. I forgot to bring up the map. Um, yeah, so this is a totally different area. This doesn't count. What? I wonder if I should catch him anyway just to have him. Right? He's gonna come through here. Oh, sh snap. White Rudel. I would put the trap there, but I know he's gonna take it. Let's see how this goes. Don't take it. Oh, he just... Damn! <laughs> Maybe he's too big. Maybe I need a different type of... Uh... Crap, I'll get this white rubble though, probably. Sandals, 
Is that rude of stuff? Okay, so we can only have two more. I'm not gonna mess around over here too much. What in the hell? Oh, snap. Oh, that's a... Was that that's a bug snap? <laughs> oh my god. Alright. A bag of pretzels. So we got one more in this area that we gotta find. Uh... There we go. Sweetie fly. So we don't have anything that catches flying bugs at the moment, I would I guess. <laughs> oh, it's like a lollipop. Alright. I'm loving my hands. Um so I think, yeah, we just needed to scan them. We didn't need to capture them, so we're good to go back to Bethlehem. If we can uh, not die. Bunger. You gotta love the bunkers. OMG, you really got them all. I knew I picked the right Grumpus. Not that I'm surprised. After all, I've read all your articles. Even if I don't believe in the Grumpa Cabra or whatever, your interviews were always on point. Good picks, too. You've got a way of digging up the truth out of the lies. But enough about you. Let's talk Bethica. I want you to use that journalistic instinct to find out what my favorite bug snack is. And feed it to me, Obs. I bet it's the, I bet it's the glizzy. That told me everything. Still playing solitaire. Um, yeah. So when we scanned that uh hot dog, it said it was her favorite one. So the weenie worm. Oh my god! I forgot it does that. <laughs> That's Good terrifying. Answer. You really get me. I know you're just doing this stuff for me because you want me back in Snacksburg, but I don't mind. If you really want to be besties with me, I want some dirt. Wambus acts totally mysterious before he goes to bed around 10 every night. I want you to find out what he's up to and tell me. If you don't want to wait around, you can always just take a nap until it's time. <laughs> later take a nap between 10 and 1 a.m. so that should work right midnight it <laughs> slept for hours and you still have a hot dog for an arm Alright, let's go see what's up with, uh, Wambert. Oh, wow! Hell, How did the ship get here? Oh, there's a balloon? Huh. You know, it, it looks just a little bit, um, exploded. But uh, I'm sure we can patch that up, eventually. Oh, it's yours? Well, you travel in style, buddy. <laughs> Well, if you don't mind, I'd love to fly it someday. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, man, but you're not flying it with strawberry arm, strawberry hand and carrot arm. Oh, yeah, we got to find out what Wambus does. Damn it. I wonder if the time limit passed already. Dang, time passes so fast in this.
Yeah, farming didn't go so well today. Soil's depleted, but I won't give up yet. I wonder how your day is going. Oh, Triffy, I miss you so much. I would hug your cactus facsimile, but it would only hurt me further. I am Wambus. Howdy, stranger. I could use your help with something. See, nobody's figured out how bug snacks reproduce. But I got an idea. I think I might be able to garden them. Grow them in the dirt, like plants. Well, half of them look like fruit, but I reckon there's more to it than that. I've seen bug snacks crawl out of the dirt that weren't there before. Fresh and gooey-like. Seems promising to me. All I need to start off is a root and a fruit. Should be simple enough. <laughs> A root and a fruit. Gotcha. A root and a fruit. Do wait, do I have anything to plant? That might have been it. I wonder if that's what he was talking about. If so, that worked out pretty well. Was it cyclists? Roots and fruits. Oh yeah, sorry. I was just talking to Wambus then. Oh, my dog's sleeping. I ain't gonna wake him up. Let's go back to Bethlehem. She's always awake, huh? <laughs> OMG, Wambus has a fake cactus wife? Like he wasn't prickly enough already. 10 out of 10, perf dirt. Uh, Snacksburg sounds way more fun than sitting around in this cave. I thought it'd be relaxing, but it's totes boring. Plus, I don't know nearly enough about you yet. I'm just itching to dig up more dirt. See you around town. Dr. Sodi. Oh, yeah. Dr. Sodi. Wait. So we can actually still use that bed, that's not bad. Um, maybe that's a good idea, just so when we go back we know Wampus should be up. It's already a five. Yeah, we'll just sleep till noon, that's fine. So that was cool. That actually worked out well, getting the, the white rudel and the 
straw capturing a straw being a white rubble. Everything good? You tell me, man. Thank you kindly. I'll get those bug snacks growing. You'll see. <laughs> My guy, man. So long, stranger. Fill ball. Alright, somewhere near the beach. Snacksburg is inhabited again. A surprising discovery. You. You are the ignoble journalist. Despite your lack of any and all useful skills, I require your assistance. As is extracting feces from the latrine. Now, my experiments were halted with the unfortunate disappearance of Egabel. Since the settlement's dissolution, finding new subjects has been vexing. A bit of gastronomic biochemistry. Never mind the details. Silence yourself and listen. You've likely witnessed grumpus limbs transforming into bug snacks. I call this process snackification. Under normal circumstances, this occurs at random. However, I have developed a method to direct the effect to specific limbs. It's simple once you understand the internal mechanisms behind the molecular dissemination of snack particles. <sighs> this is the Snacktivator. Feed me Strabby. Poke Snacktivator in foot. Foot turns into Strabby. Understand? <clears throat> Intriguing. <laughs> Very good. I will allow you to field test the Snacktivator for the time being. I, meanwhile, have some very interesting plans for my leg. I look forward to working with you further. Okay. Ah, okay. New type of sauce. Gotcha. Okay. Nope. They respawn relatively fast too, so. Nice hot spring here. Weeble. Someone's gotta like the Queeble. I'm capturing one. I love Kiwi. A raspberry. But they're probably easy as hell to catch. I'm not really worried about raspberries. Crapple. <laughs> Crapple. Don't attack me, dude. Crapple. Seashell. Snackery. Crabble. Where's Gramble at? Is that a pineapple?
max out on the chocolate. Actually, before we talk to Gramble, now that we know where he is, I'm just gonna... I should be able to interview Befica, uh, like I did with Wambus. So I'm gonna find her at, uh, Snacksburg and then come right back here. Just cause I don't wanna forget. She's not home. Interesting. She's in Philbo's house. What the hell is hey she there, doing? how's it going? I thought you'd never ask. OMG, I have so many hot takes. I bet. I'm Befica Winklesnew, and I basically do whatever I want. <laughs> Let's just say I'm an information specialist. Oh, they're so cute, I could literally eat them up. And I do! Ugh, there's drama, and then there's drama! We have too many Geminis around here, and I'm done getting caught up in social dumpster fires. Oh, hey! My cave was sweet! Plus, it was close enough to Wambus that I could swipe some sauce when I needed to. Cromdo. That greedy little squeeb started looting the second Liz was gone. Then, he tried to sell me her projector. So, I like posted pics of all his little crimes, and then I got out of there before he could get back at me. I'm here on vacay. Uh, unrelated fun fact, did you know that no international laws apply out here? I'm just saying, if you got in trouble, like a lot of trouble and all your friends turned against you, this would be a great place to hide out forever. What don't I know about Lizbert? Wink. Uh, Liz is smart and fearless, and she can see the talent in all of us. It's impossible not to look up to her. She's practically invincible. But she does have one weakness. Bell. Liz would go to the end of the world and back to make her happy. And if I've learned anything in life, it's that you can't let your happiness depend on somebody else. Liz and Agabelle got in a big argument before Liz went hunting. I haven't seen either of them since. If I'm being optimistic, maybe they're on a romantic getaway sorting it out together? No prob. I'm just happy to see your interview skills in action. Oh, and before you go, I think you should take this. <laughs> Snatched it. It's the key to Liz's cabinet. The stuff in there is really personal, but finding her is more important than keeping all her secrets. <laughs> Sorry, interview's over. Don't let me down, bestie. <laughs> okay. Oh god, Philbo. Alright, so...
I wonder if we have access to Liz's house. Let's find out anyway. We're right here. Nice. Is that all we can grab? Yeah, it looks like it. Excuse me, Beth. I'm back in town after a narrow escape from a pack of vicious bug snacks. Just in time for a gorgeous doctor to treat my grievous wound. Well, this gorgeous doctor thinks you're an idiot. Oh, well, that stinks. And after I face those snacks just for you, don't joke around. I you're taking risks to impress me, but you are impressed, yes? Ow. You're lucky it's such a shallow cut. And stop squirming around, or I'll have to restrain you. Take a bill, not while the camera is on. Trying to look strong for your audience. <clears throat> so, how's it look, Bill? Think I'll be up and hunting soon? No, you need to stay a while, Liz. <laughs> Phil Bo over there. Hey, Gabriel. You miss me that much? I just want you in peak hunting condition. <laughs> uh, speaking of, you haven't seen the hall for my latest excursion. Ooh, did you bring me something good? You tell me. It's a brand new snack. And you'll be the first to try it. Oh, Liz, you spoil me. I got a story for you. Bill, are you okay? Worthless. That's not true. You're just having one of those days. Everything is one of those days. Did something happen? Everything happened. Tiffany broke her leg. Gramble got food poisoning. I couldn't help both of them. Everybody was shouting at me. I didn't know what to do. None of that's your fault. What's the point if I can't help anybody? I just sit here all day while everybody else is out there all productive and happy. That's not true. You help me all the time. Like when I cut my paw. You only got hurt because you were getting snacks from me. It'd be fine if I wasn't around. Don't say that. I need you, Bill. You were there when the world was laughing at me. You were there for me during the worst days of my life. I'm here for you, too. This world can suck an egg. I know what'll make you feel better. Yeah, thanks, Liz. I fall to pieces without you. She's being really annoying. Here's Stop taking pictures. Work. Another fine day behind us. Nothing like a campfire. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> Wiggle, your song's nice and all, but you're scaring the little ones. Well, sorry, Gramble. Inspiration is so hard to find. I just have to sing wherever it strikes me. Well, uh, maybe it could strike you over there. Oh, but I'd hate to go alone. Won't you join me for a long walk on the beach? Like a date? Of course, darling. It would just be you, me, and your delectable strabbies. Singing the night away until we drift off to sleep. No! Uh, sorry. Every time I go to sleep around you, my snacks just up and vanish. So no to all that. But the date's still a maybe. Oh, very well. I will go and seek my inspiration. Hello! Ta, my dear. Oh, calm down, little ones. Wiggle means well. She just don't understand you like I do. Who are you? I haven't seen you around here before. If you're looking for bug snacks, you best turn back. These little ones are my kin. Well, that's a relief. Sorry to be short with you. I haven't slept much lately. I'm Gramble Giggle Funny. I'm an aspiring bug snacks breeder. I'm not too keen on going to town, but I'm running out of room down here. I want to get back to my barn. Trouble is, some of my snacks went missing. I'm not going back till they're all home. If you want to help me, then I got a friend to introduce you to. Follow me. <laughs> That's adorable. See that, Strabby? That there's Sprout. I've been training him to follow my pointer in his buggy ball. We were in the middle of training. See if you can guide Sprout back here to us. <laughs> always been a good judge of character. Sprout loves adventure. Always got along well with Lisbert, too. <laughs> anyway, I'm missing my three peel bugs. They like to hide out inside little holes around the beach. Please find them. Those little cuties must be so scared without me. Nice. I'll take it. my three peel bugs they like to hide out inside little holes around the beach please find them those little cuties must be so scared without me <laughs> okay so we know where one is at least 
right? Or no, there's one in here. There's one, I know there's... There's one in the log, I didn't know there's one here, so we know where two of them are, I guess. Whoops. Got him. Nice. Dang it. Got him anyway. So we just gotta find one more. Hopefully in one of these logs. Yep. So, you actually got to be pretty fast to switch. Apple? Where did that one lady go that I... I wanted to scan her. I don't think I'll see her again. Yet. She went this way. <laughs> Crapple! trap much I still got two quibbles missing but I want you to bring them to me without catching them in your trap <laughs> lucky you got sprout to help out smother him in chocolate and those quibbles will follow him till the end of time <laughs> hmm I already have a Queeble. I wonder if I could set it free. I can release it. We'll see if that works. Hold on, buddy. Oh, 
That didn't work. He just pretty much disappeared. I thought it was like you actually release him, you know? Thanks for all your help. I want you to take Sprout with you. He's always wanted a life of adventure. I'm just holding him back. Sprout, your papa's got a job to do. All your friends are going to a new home. You're going with this nice grumpus right here. I'll miss you something fierce, but it's okay. You can come see papa anytime. <laughs> you take care of Sprout. Or else. All right, so I think we're just going to interview uh, Grumble and then. Gramble, my bad. <laughs> and then, uh,. I'm gonna call it but we know I saw wiggle over there uh, I'm pretty sure we got something to do with wiggle yeah but for now we'll just go back to Snacksburg if I knew you were here. That's so. Well, I ain't about to leave now. Oh, yeah? Me neither. Then I reckon we're neighbors again. Howdy, neighbor. I got my eye on you, Wambus Troubleham. You best keep your eyes on your snacks. Seems like they're getting away from you. Oh, Charlie, where'd you run off to? Oh, sorry. Okay, so he's growing uh, chocolate here now, so that's hey. good. Hey! I've uh, never done an interview before. Um, how's it work?
Uh, Gramble Giggle Funny. I look after all the bug snacks in town and make sure they don't wander off. Well, they're just the cutest little things, aren't they? I don't understand how anybody could look into their googly little eyes and want to eat them. Uh, um, well, they don't eat none of mine, and that's what counts. I heard Lizbert was gathering up some grumps to be part of her new family, and I thought I could really use one of those. I did, but then they... Uh, can we talk about something else? Without Liz to bring in snacks, everybody got mighty hungry. They done treated my barn like a grocery store. I held them off for a while, but I should have known Wambus never quits. <sighs> the next night I woke up to him throwing my snacks into a sack. I panicked, and I let the rest go free. Broke my heart, but it's better than them getting eaten. I left that night for the beach and started rebuilding my family. Maybe. Wiggles a lot, but she's got a good heart. If she really likes me, she'll learn to love bug snacks the way I do. Lizbert? She'd bring me lots of new friends to take care of. Sometimes we'd work together training my little ones. Sometimes she'd ask for one and I'd have to say goodbye. I like to think they're all like Sprout, helping out like little sidekicks. But sometimes she didn't get enough on the hunt. She always liked to bring something back for Agabelle. Hmm, can we talk about something else? Sometimes I wake up at night and I'm out of bed. Lost in the woods. I think I see Lizbert out there watching me like a vengeful spirit. Uh, can, can we talk about something else? Ooh, I don't think I like interviews very much. Here, Lizbert dropped this in my barn back when. I never got around to giving it back. I don't know what it's for, but you can have it if you promise never to interview me again. <laughs> Die, Ricky. Alright. No problem, Grumble. Gramble. It looks like he has a side quest or something for us. I suppose so. Even though we're home, the little ones are still restless. I think they might be getting lonely. After all, the barn used to be chock full of bug snacks. I'd be real grateful if you'd donate a few more bug snacks to my barn. Maybe a half dozen or so six bugs now so i got two on me well, i don't know i'd be real grateful if well how do i do that ah okay Cool. Um, looks like Philbo wants to talk to us, and we have the key to Lizbert's diary. So, um, on the next episode, we'll just start off right here, and uh, we'll take care of that. But uh, that's Wamber. I'm not sleeping with that Wamber's bed. I'm actually just gonna go back to the cave and. Uh, I don't know how it auto saves, but I'm guessing uh, if you sleep, it should auto save. But yeah, we'll just talk to. Actually, we'll get the open the diary with the key next time we start and uh, talk to Philbo, see what he has going on. Um, actually, before I. Uh, before I go back that way, next time I play, I'll capture a few more bug snacks and uh, donate them to the ranch. So 
so we can uh, kind of kill two birds with one stones. But um, yeah, that's gonna be it for this. What time is it? I sleep until noon. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Um, all that good stuff. Comment, like, subscribe. Uh, I'm gonna bring more of this pretty soon. Um, I don't think this game is too long, but uh, I'm having fun with it, and uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks.